everyone. Hope you're all well. All right, today you've already seen the front. It's no good playing this guessing game. We're going to try a lemon meringue. Now you've got an advantage over us here because we don't know how this is going to end up. Um, we're going to do the pastry, Wendy is, and make the mix and everything. And if we get it's successful up to the lemon meringue stage or well, we still ain't made his mind up we're a little bit worried that the air fryer might destroy it and oh. blow it all over the place and we'll see how it goes if it's looking promising or oh, i might have to switch the main oven on it don't really bother me but it's a bit of a worry no it's just more money mate but if it makes a better job that's what we'll have to do, but we'll think about this as we're going along. Anyway, we'll make a start and I'll come back to you. Right, we're about right, ready now, everybody. So, right, Wendy, you make a start then. Yeah. Off we go. This it, has got salt in now, a pinch Yeah, of the salt's salt. in the flour already. If you use your mind mixer, nice civic, yeah. This is the only reason I'm doing this. I know that. I love it, I do. I want to go. You want that? Well, we yeah, want it, won't we? Yeah, we're ready. We'll put it on there. For now, and <clears throat> in goes the lard. Should be telling you how much is in at every stage, but I can never remember. God, I'm useless. This is a um, no. This is this fun. is not open on the right page here. Oh, Hang I've moved it. Sorry. It. Right, we've got the book on the right page, and what we're using is the B-row book. Look. We've used it plenty of times, haven't we? And that is eight ounces of plain flour. Say so the pinch of salt's gone in, and now 50 grams of lard's gone in. Did I say eight ounces of flour? So it's two ounces of lard, two ounces of margarine, and two tablespoons of water, and then one ounce of castor, castor sugar. And that gives you 225 grams of flour. It's still a pinch of salt, even when it's metric. Mm. 50 grams of lard, 50 grams of margarine, and it's still, oh, 30 millilitres of water, and 25 grams of caster sugar. You say it's all in the book, look. We know what we're doing, don't we? No. Right. We were going to make this with digestive biscuits, but I like the 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 proper one. We've seen you can make this with digestive biscuits, bis biscuits, biscuits, <laughs> and that appealed to me. I thought this looks all right, but Wendy's a bit worried. Oh, she wants to use short cusp pastry, so that's what we're doing. Well, that's so, we're not what using, it was. so I'll just have to dump we, the digestives well, in the tea. I'm not bothered. We can do that at some other point. Yeah, I think the big mm. worry at the moment is whether the air fryer would destroy the meringue. So we might have the oven on. We still ain't made his mind up. Right, yet. that's all mixed in to make your breadcrumb consistency. So next, you're putting the sugar in, aren't you? Now? That's the sugar, because it's sweet pastry. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's what you say. Sweet pastry, castor sugar, yeah. and mix that together. This is not going to take long, is it? And then just your uh, wash them up. Huh? Them up. I'm not going to wash it up. Mm. I think that's all rubbed in. That's in. Or is it now? Your water in it? Yeah. All right. Oh, I'm only watching. <laughs> need just to bring it together right that's two tablespoons of water i keep repeating myself here don't i so we'll mix that in now hopefully it'll come together sometimes i do this it needs just a bit more water i don't know i think things are well, I reckon it depends on the mm. flour. Mm. So who knows? This get some right, just but... get some cold water just in case, but it don't cost. Oh, it does, doesn't it? <laughs> Low 
change in there. I don't want to play with it too much. No. little drop in it's just oh that's a bit too much but you'd put flour into it anyway I don't want to play with it too much that's the thing some cling film and put in the fridge. Mm. Right now that dough's done we'll flatten it down a little bit to make a disc, wrap it up in some cling film and in the fridge for 20 minutes half an hour. Right we'll get back to you. Right I brought you back everybody just to show you this tart tin. Um, this is quite new but I'll tell you what it's turned out fantastic. I mean, we're never in any doubt, but it does seem to make a good job. So I think I'm tempting fate there telling you that. But the, I know they have a removable bottom, but this is full of holes and it seems to work really well. Anyway, Wendy's going to make a start now. So I'll put the tray back down. Put it over there out your way. Right, we've had half an hour in the fridge, so... Wendy's going to roll it out and put it in the... Uh, I tell you what, this tin. pastry isn't as good. I don't know if it's the flour or is it the cook. We've got new flour, haven't we? I don't know, it just seemed a bit... Yeah, but we've got new flour. I've just opened mm, it this morning. I know. Don't last it's long it. It just sort, seems a bit... I don't know. It's just me, probably. Flour you always say, don't blame the, the tools. Don't know. Yeah, but we know the flour is not always the same. Mm. I don't know what make it was. It's all right, but it just seems it's not... It's all in there? Yeah, it's in there with the bags. Right. I've thrown away. Yeah, we always tip it into the B-Row container. It just didn't feel right, but... I don't know. It's Aldi's, won't well, it? This is, it's just, mm. I don't know, I suppose it makes any difference. This is Aldi's plain flour. Uh, mm. Got the sign on the back, mate. Always a giveaway, I'm learning. Um, yeah, it's just this flour. We'll see if it works. I bet it does. But anyway, mm. just so we know. Which flower it is? Probably just me. It's not as playable. Yeah, and we've uh, what we did the other day. We did it on bake. But we didn't put it on the crisper tray we put it on the bottom and it, it did seem to cook it more even i know it was different pastry but i think when we blind bake it that's what we'll do we'll do 180 20 minutes on the bake setting and i think that'll come out okay but say we'll have a look when we get there want to not cook too much off aren't you really I think we did, didn't we? Well, I think our case actually 
Mm. I think in the B row book, the case is actually an inch bigger. Is it? So I think this is an eight inch and that were nine. So yeah. that could be it. But it's not the end of the world. To make some jam tarts. Yeah. <laughs> It's a bit thin, but it'll do. So this has got to be blind bait now. Yeah. I, think put, I don't think we did put holes in this one, did well, we? Well, we did last time we stabbed it, didn't we? Did we? Yeah, go on. I don't know whether it did matters because there's holes in the There's holes in the metal dish, isn't there? I don't think it matters. I don't really. think it does. Just put a few. Yeah, no need to come back, is there? Oh, God, that were a few. My lovely beads. I just like the teacher used to do with my own work. I don't know. Do you do with your kids? Just me. Might as well put them all in. Probably that shape till they've actually done it. Ah, is that too? That's all right. Yeah, they ain't we'll go up no, from there. It's not that, that low, it's high up. Yeah. Right, so what we'll do now, we'll get this in the air fryer. Let me uh, get the camera on it. There we go. Stick it in there, 180. Oh, right. I can't do yeah. it for oil. Do you want the crisper tray? No, no, put it straight in the bottom. Ooh. Supposed to warm it up first with the dog. Just pull me in. It'll be fine. The cameraman's not very good. Right. Turn it on, oh, though. Yeah, switch it on. Bake. Right. You'll switch well, it on first. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right. 180. 180. And it's on 20 minutes. 20 minutes. There you go. Go on. Yeah. Right, we'll keep an eye on that, obviously, and uh, we'll bring you back when something happens. Right, we've got to squeeze two lemons. I've took the rind off and cut them in half, ready to squeeze. But before we do, look at this, they're fabulous, aren't they? Look at that, it's a beauty, that is. It's funny, I've always been intrigued by the shape of these right from when I was a little, a little kid. But they're obviously designed like that because that's the best shape because you can still get them. So, uh, I mean, I've been doing these by hand and then I've been trying to fish the pips out after. But, uh, oh, this is so much better. Oh, that's perfect. I'll tell you what, there were no pips in there. <clears throat> I can hardly believe it. Last time I did it, there were pips everywhere. I was fishing them out for a good few minutes. But this, I was making a lovely job of that. Ah, there's a pip. And another one. And look how it catches it. It's fantastic. Just made for the job. Right, I'll have to empty that out for do the other two. Anyway, we'll come back to you when there's something else to show you. Right, we've brought you back because we've got the uh, blind bait case out, which is still warm. Oh, it is. Oh, we're going to show you. It's too warm to pick up. It's cooling down. So while that's cooling down, Wendy's going to make the mixture. Um, I squeezed the lemons and got the rind. I used two lemons for that. We've got two egg yolks and the whites. Where's the egg whites gone? Up there. Oh, of course it's. <laughs> Crikey. They nearly bit me, didn't they? I didn't see them. Um, then we've got two bowls of sugar, each with a 112... <coughs> sorry. <coughs> Caster sugar, sugar, 112 grams or four <laughs> ounce. Uh, what... What's that? Um, That's the... Uh, uh, what's the name? Cornflour. Is it? Yeah. Oh yeah, how much cornflour was that? Um, Two tables. I've, I've not got the book in me. I've, I've got the book this. down. It's one ounce. One ounce. Right. See, we're messing about. Give me the book. Yeah. yeah. We're half ounces and half grams I'm here. I'm trying to catch your book. It's getting crazy, isn't it? Here we go. There's the lemon meringue. 
Yeah, corn flour, one ounce or 25 grams. Oh, and we've got to have a quarter of a pint of boiling water. Have you got the kettle on? Mm, yeah, but it's not been on yet. Yeah, get the we'll kettle back on. Get the kettle on and when it's on, we'll bring you back and we'll make a start. Right, let's get this cooker switched on. Get the pan on. That one there. And I always like to make sure I'm using the right one. I don't want to burst everything. Well, the boiling That's water. Right. right. Start going in there. So now we're adding all the ingredients together. So that one. Yeah, I should put the sugar in and mix it up, I think. Sugar? Wouldn't you? Just to melt it a little bit. Can okay. do. It doesn't actually tell you that, but no. I'm sure that makes sure? sense. Yeah, go on. You said it. Well. <laughs> right. Just mix it up a bit and then put the lemon in and the juice and the rind. That's it. And the lemon juice. Oh, it smells beautiful, doesn't it? I hope so. Mix it together. And uh and that's mixed together, get the egg in there, but I thought you had to mix the corn flour with cold water. Will it be all right in there? It should do, yeah. Well, we'll see, won't we? We'll see. Well, yeah, if we've we'll got... soon find out. It doesn't mention it in here, but... Mm. Are you sure the, uh, I reduce the heat after the, when the flour's in? Yeah, you can oh, do. I yeah. just turned it full back so it um, gets it warm. Yeah, go on. So it's not going to scramble. I don't know what's going to happen. That's still all it says. Mm -hmm. It's gone. <laughs> yeah, you've got to bring it to the boil. Mm. So I yeah. should get the, get the flour in there as well before it gets too hot. Mm. Is it all right? Mm. Trying to break the egg up. Mm. Yeah, get your... Uh... That's it. Get your corn flour in, get whisk. it all mixed up and then bring it back to the boil. Want a whisk. You want the whisk? Whisk. That's it, just in case. Don't trust myself. I suppose you would be better with a whisk, wouldn't you? Mm. Try not to... Is it mixing okay? Well, I felt a hard lump at the bottom, so it's obviously doing some that. Well, as I look back, it says blend the corn flour with a little cold water. Yeah, well, I thought so. so. I didn't see they tell you that. It, mm. it tells you to mix the other and then the next section, it says blend <laughs> the corn flour with a little cold water. Yeah. And add, add to the lemon mixture, bring to the boil. That's how you do and custard, isn't it? You... Well, yeah. All right. It's, it's, it's the boiling water that threw us out because it says, yeah. It tells you to use boiling water and mix it well. Mm. So anyway, it's gone all right, hasn't it? I think so, but it's got to thicken up, obviously. Yeah, well, it'll thicken up when you mm. boil it, won't it? It ain't gone lumpy. It says, well, that's fine then. Mm. It says bring it to the boil and then pour it into the case. Mm. Yeah, the only thing we've missed there is we didn't mix the corn flour with a little bit of cold water, but it seems to have worked anyway. <laughs> It is hard when you're on camera, isn't it? I told you before. <laughs> you say to me, you forgot this, you forgot that. You know, sometimes I used to forget to turn the cap. Hang on, is that camera working? <laughs> I think it is. Hey, come on, it's it's thickening. Yeah, it, well, I, I think can so, see it. Look, it? oh, it's, it's growing, but yeah. I suppose I should put my hand this way. Well, you're going to put your hand in it. <laughs> Don't do that. Well, I think it is, unless it's my imagination open. Leave it to go for a bit. 
it was them eggs scared me because I thought it just seemed a bit weird. I thought yeah. I think the eggs should have gone in after the cornflour. We better have a better read. I'll tell you yeah. what, we'll keep mixing this and I'll bring you back when it's looking oh, a bit better. That's uh, boiled and thickened up as you can see there. So what we're going to do, turn that heat off and uh, just put that on another ring for the moment yeah. and we'll let it cool down slightly. Probably just a few minutes because yeah, we don't want to tip it red hot into the case. So no. we'll tip it in the case. We'll just give that a couple of minutes to cool down and I'll bring you back. Right, we've let that cool a few minutes and it's starting to get a little thicker so we'll get it in the case. You didn't want to make it too early, but you don't want to leave it too late. It's starting to set in that yeah, as well. Yeah, it is so starting to set, isn't it? We've done it right, <laughs> we think. Oh, hang on. What? There's a, little, there's a little drip there. Oh, for God's sake. Well, it tastes all right. We'll be getting told off, you know, for using fingers. It tastes of lemon. Does Can it? Don't scrape any more out, because that's lovely. Mm. Right, that's, uh, we want it nice and flat, but that's, that's worked out lovely. Well, we, <laughs> stop so being. So <laughs> no, you've got the best. That, mm -hmm. that's worked out lovely, look at that. Mm. Shake it around, it might settle on its own anyway. That's fine, that is. Oh, I'm mm. pleased with that, mm. whether you are or not. Right, now, the next bit. It's the dodgy bit, isn't it? Making, yeah, making the meringue. I've only got a cheap. A cheap mixer. Mixer. <laughs> it's like me, I'm cheap as well. <laughs> We're all cheap here. Right, we'll get this sorted um, out and we'll come back to you. But so far, so good. Right, I brought you back because we're going to whisk the egg white. That doesn't look a lot to me, but... <laughs> that don't look enough to whisk. Mm. That's what it said, isn't yeah. it? should make right, you've got to put over your head <laughs> yeah oh look that Is it that looks peaks? okay yeah that's got that's on yes. its peak that's people have said small whisks don't do it, it i to used to do it, it by an hour well this has done it yeah right let's get this off here and we'll get it on top yeah, I'll, I'll just bring you back right now that mixed very well i'm pleased with that so now we'll get it, the topping onto there and then we're going in the oven. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I'll tell you what, we're going to try it in the air fryer. Oh. Yeah, come on, it, it's gone really well and oh. come on, let's try it. Oh dear. Um, you'll, you'll be washing it off you. You've got to start near the edge, haven't you? Yeah. Somebody said, I don't know it was, but start near the edge oh. and then build it up. We can't have that mat on because... Oh. We've had the ring on, so we've we're had all the right. ring on. But you've got to start near the edge and all work right, Hold it. on. Did you want to do it? It's that stiff, look. You can't do it. It's like ice cream. You've gone too far. It looks all right. This does. 
let's just hope <laughs> that it don't fly in pieces but really yeah we could chicken out but i feel we should try it i'm feeling lucky oh, go ahead punk make my day good old clint now then mm -hmm. Oh, I'm still scared. I can't make my mind. You're no, scared. No, come on, we'll try, I'm scared of me. Don't we'll it? try yeah. the air fryer. We'll try the air fryer. Can you remember when you did oh, them anyway. boiled eggs in the air fryer? That's how I feel at the moment. Yeah, but you, you find out, right? Making hundreds of these to find out which is the best way. <laughs> I mean, the eggs, it's got easier and easier, hasn't it? Because you're more used to the air fryer. But I hope this is not like that. Oh, I want it now, look. Let's not bother with the cooking, let's just eat it. <laughs> I'll tell you what, this might last for some time. So I'll bring you back. Well, that's it, done. Let's give you a look at that. Might actually be the last time you ever see it. <laughs> because if it, if it all goes wrong in the air front, look, it's a good size, that is. I'm packing me. I think it's going to be just saying, right. He kept saying, pile it on, pile it on. Pile it on, pile it on. Yeah, on. get it on there, it's lovely. I'm packing my suitcase, You're I better. am. <laughs> right, let's get it in the oven. Right, I've placed it inside, and I know this is a scary bit, isn't it? We feel like we're launching a rocket to the moon. So, I've decided, and I know nothing, <laughs> we're going to go back on bake and we're going to go 150. Oh, oh. Yeah, 20 minutes. And we're going to go for it and we'll keep my eye on it and hope for the best. Oh, no. And we'll bring you back when we know where we are. Oh, dear. Oh. <laughs> right. We've got 15 minutes left, so we've only had five minutes, but let's have a look. Have the draw a bit. Let's have a look. Oh, dear. Oh. oh, it's perfect. Oh. Well, go on, oh. shove her back in. That, oh. looked, that looked all right to me, so it's looking oh. promising. Mm -hmm. No, I won't bother it. When you were fretting, not me. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'll bring you back in a bit. Well, we've got eight minutes left, so let's have a look. Well, it's changing colour slightly. Yeah, it's got a bit darker colour. I think that's all right, look, mm. isn't it? We feel the peaks. Don't break it. Mm. Is it going hard? It is. I can't feel it because I've got both hands full. Let's put it back in. Now, we've got eight minutes left on it, but whether that's right or wrong... Well, it's nice it's not sure. crunchy, isn't it? It is, so we'll come back in a few minutes and have another look. Well, there we go. There's the beeps. Mm. That looks great. Mm. That looks brilliant. Put it on the. Just lift it onto there. If you th do you think it's done? I think so, yeah. Can't really. Oh, yeah. What that feels think? fabulous. <laughs> mm. <laughs> I don't know what to say. We've got to let it cool down. I'm going to burn my mouth. Look. Let's try and lift it out. Don't, don't me. No, don't. Don't me towards the camera. No, you're all right. I've got it now. I've, I'm working the camera at the same time. Everything's gone too good. I don't know if we drop it, it won't. That. Look at the size of it. It looks good. So that's your, your eyes are bigger now, than look, your belly. Look at that. I know it's still in the in the uh, case. I'm straighten it over there. It's the same all the way around. Look, it looks fantastic. Well, I'm over the moon with this. I mean... Yeah, Wendy, we're worried about it going in the uh, fryer. Look at that. I'm really pleased with that. That looks so good. All it needs now is a well, cherry on the top. It's got, to, <laughs> it's got to cool down now. I can't touch it. Oh, nope. dear. I'll have to bring you back later. Not to a tea. Right, let's cut this lemon meringue and have a look. Just cut a slice out so we can see. Mm. Wanting a small plate. There yeah, you do. <laughs> and got a plate to put it on. That's good planning. <clears throat> oh my go. God! Oh dear, oh dear. 
Oh, does it look fantastic or what? That looks great to me. That's just, oh, didn't think it'd be that good. I don't know why. That's lovely. Well, we've cut that slice out of that meringue. Look at that. Well, I can't see anything wrong with that. I understand we've not tasted it yet. It could be vile, but I'm sure it's not going to be. But I thought I'd just show you that. To me, that looks perfect. So, anyway, let's get another slice cut. We'll have one each and tell you what we think. Right, I brought you back because we cut a piece of that meringue. And, well, you can see what it's like. I think I've already shown you. But I'm going to show you again because, mate, this has gone so well. Um, and also, you can see, I've already eaten some. Um, now, I really like meringue. I always have, all my life. It's just lovely, isn't it? But... I don't know much about it to be honest but I do know one thing I've never had a meringue better than this this is gorgeous I don't know what we've done right but it's it's definitely right mmm well I did feel that the the lemon there I thought well we're gonna mess this up with I think we didn't quite do it right but Oh, it tastes nice and this meringue and the pastry as well I think Wendy's really got the hang of that because I'm oh, sorry you shouldn't talk you shouldn't eat and talk at the same time and I know I don't but I don't know how to explain to you how nice this is this ain't gonna last long in this house hmm well do a bit of effort went into that but I think it was effort well spent that's gone really really well right if you've enjoyed please like and subscribe and if you'd like to send me a message I'll get back to you and we'll see you on the next one bye